Hello, Badger mates, and welcome back. Um, so, first of all, try a different sort of lipstick than Lauren's. Um, the reason why is because I have a lot of lipsticks, and I want to kind of see which ones I would wear and which ones I don't, and today, throughout the day, these actually worked, but I'm not sure on camera. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. It's, um... Too Faced Shimmer, Shimmering Marshmallow, I think. Marshmallow Baby, I think it's called. Um, if I'm wrong, I'll put it somewhere. But today's video is something that's just kind of silly, but I think it's kind of fun. Um, because, so, story time. Uh, a friend of mine, Liv, hi Liv, if you're watching. Um, I've decided to be each other's support on trying to be healthier and so that we can lose weight and because both of us are getting to the point where at least me for sure for sure like for me I'm, I'm starting to like not fit into my clothes and I want to fit in my clothes I don't want to buy bigger clothes I want to buy smaller clothes because I got rid of a lot of bigger clothes when I lost weight which was great um but now I'm gaining weight and <sighs> Anyway, so she and I are supporting each other and doing this. And one of the biggest things that I know helped me when I lost the weight was making smoothies or fruit and vegetable drinks. And in order to do that, you need a blender. And ever since I got here, I was thinking I should get a blender. But then I was like, oh, I don't know if I want to get a blender because then I'm spending money on something that I'm only going to have X amount of time to have and etc cetera, etc cetera. now I've come to the point where it's like okay I'm realizing how much I need a blender in my life so today I bought a blender now I didn't buy a very expensive blender I mean it was about 30 pounds the one that I did see when I first came to England was at Asda and that one was about like 15 16 pounds but it looks cheap. And I was like, ooh. And that was just my personal opinion on the product. I didn't try the product, but it looked super cheap and I didn't think it was going to work. And this seemed much better. I got it at a store called Lakeland, which they seem to have really cool products. And I actually am thinking, man, I would only buy out their catalog of kitchenware. Cause that's one thing that I love to buy is kitchenware. Um, I just love going through kitchen sections and looking at what they have. I am kind of a snob when it comes to it, but being here, um, I kind of just sometimes since I'm on a budget, I just um, just I was like, whatever. I don't need the greatest thing. I'm a student at the moment and I'm not settling. Um, so I did buy this. Now this was was $29.99. Um, with tax and or VAT and everything because they call it VAT here instead of tax. Um, which if I really like it, I kind of want to like just get a converter for it and keep it. But I know like probably if I got my own place and everything, if I had the money, I would actually just invest in a Vitamix because those things are amazing. But this is kind of nice. So we got the box here and it comes with two little like it's a personal blender so that can um have like little your own little like bottles of like smoothies and juices and stuff so um it comes with two sizes and a base and i don't know if it comes with interchangeable blades or anything but we're we're gonna find oh it's a bladed lid it's like um oh okay so it's like um the magic bullet sort of thing where it has a bladed light so we're gonna open it together because i haven't opened it and i haven't tried it and then probably in the morning but in the same video i'm going to like make something with it so this is what it looks like inside the box Ooh, different parts this is just makes me happy okay so let's open up this little package first and i have to wash the things anyway so um and it's about, it's after midnight tonight, so I really don't need to eat anything. Um, probably just need to drink. So we get a lid. 
It has a like little like um thing you can clip on. It has a flip top. Ooh, that has a little bit of plastic there. Um, and then you just drink out of it. So there's that. Well, actually, I shouldn't throw this away yet. I should figure out if it all works. I don't want to there. I should figure out if this all works first before I like do anything else. Um, so let's go with this. This is um, one of the sizes of the containers with its own little lid. So it's only little lid. This is a 400 milliliter cup. So this is a smaller one if I feel like having a smaller smoothie. Um, that today, so this is good. And then this is the one that goes with this one. And it's got the stuff that you can pop, pop, pop. Um, come on out, stop sticking. And then this is the bigger one, which is, to be honest, unless I feel like this might blend better because of the fact that it's a smaller thing, it might get everything. But if I add enough water in here, Maybe I'll use this for like my juicy sort of thing and this for my like smoothies. Like, cause I have this delicious chocolate, banana, peanut butter, cherry smoothie that really actually helped me lose weight and not crave candy or chocolate that much. So, um, so we have this one, which is excuse, not dangerous with that, uh, 600 milliliters. So this is about 200, it's not twice as much, but it's, um, half so it's a half a size and a half so one and a half of these equals this which is kind of nice so we're gonna put that lid on show you how it looks like it's carried on the go and this is the sharp blade which actually i'm gonna probably take the top off to put this on so i don't cut myself so this is a blade <laughs> be careful kids um so yeah it turns around like that this is for adults only, and especially adults who are careful and do not want to kill themselves or hurt themselves or cut themselves or go to the emergency room all of a sudden because there's blood gushing everywhere. Um, so that side is good, so I'm going to throw all of this in here. Really quick, this was really, really cool for storage purposes. You know how the bottom's like this? That's pretty awesome. And then you just put it, put it on top like this, and you just leave it there. I think that's pretty cool. Okay, see you in the morning. And it's the next day. So we're gonna make a drink, a smoothie, a loveliness. Um, I have my ingredients here. I cut them up beforehand. And I'm just gonna make it here. Usually I would just make it in the kitchen, but here. So I have some spinach and then I have some oats and I have this um, mixed seed thing which is flaxseed, sunflower, and pumpkin seed and this is actually great for me. I need lots of things and then I also have cucumber just chopped roughly, um, kiwi quartered, four strawberries quartered, and then half a lemon. So um, so let's get started. First, I'm going to um, put in, oh man, maybe I should have cut the, it's half a cucumber, but the, with the way that I have like the room in this thing, probably won't use the whole cucumber unless um, I blend it up and let's see how it goes. So right now I put in the strawberry, the kiwi, Half of the half of the cucumber, and then all the strawberries. Um, since that also is a lot of liquid, we're going to. I'm going to add a little bit of my water here. Um, and pour it over here. I'm going to blend it up a little bit. Ooh, hold on. Got to remove these seeds. Otherwise, it will be weird. Put in some lemon juice. There's a seed that got in there, but whatever. Um, and then, probably overstuff this. Oh, come on. Push it down. 
and then you put on your blade. Okay, and you put this to the side. So I'm going to do this into steps because I did not cut my cucumber small enough. So you just need to do that. All right. So this is, this is what it looks like. I put it in. I turn on the on button. Did I turn? Okay, yeah, that's on. So, okay, wait. Am I missing something? Did I get a dud? One second. After about like 15 minutes trying to figure stuff out, I realized how to work the thing. I'm sorry, for some reason, I'm very yellow. So, I have this. I know it looks a little gross, but I'm going to thicken it up a little bit. I'm I'm going to think I'm just going to eat the cucumber by myself as is. So, I'm going to add a little bit of the... Oh, so what I was... Me um, I'm going to add some oats. Now, what I was messing up on was... Um, you push it down, you twist it, and then you turn on the button. Uh, yeah. Who would have thought? Uh, and then, what else do I need to add? I'm going to add some spinach. Stuff you down. And then, where's my... Okay, there's my seeds. And then a little bit of seeds. And I think that will be enough. I hope I didn't overfill it. There we go. All right, so... I will be right back and blend some more because it's plugged in over in the kitchen. So see you later. All right, here it is. And it looks grossish, but it's not. It's green. It's going to be good. I've had something like this before. Mm, that is good. I did add a little bit more spinach than the rest of the cucumbers because it did all fit. I was like, oh, that's still not overfilling it, I think. Where's the thing? Where's the line? Oh, the line's the other way. We're now going to test the... Where's this line? Oh, it's right there. Yeah, the line is way up here, so I could have added a little bit something else, but it's really good. Um, But yeah, so that's my exciting new toy, a blender. So thank you so much for watching, and until next time, badger out.